गुड मॉर्निंग माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू सेंट माइकल्स एकेडमी बेटियाज ई लर्निंग क्लास ऑफ मॉरल साइंस ऑफ स्टैंडर्ड वन चिल्ड्रेन टुडे वी विल स्टार्ट आवर न्यू चैप्टर दैट इज चैप्टर फोर हेल्पफुल अली सो नाउ लेट्स स्टार्ट आवर चैप्टर इन फर्स्ट पैराग्राफ वेन अली वेन टू स्कूल ऑन मंडे His friends asked him, "Hey Ali, what did you do all weekend?" Ali thought about his weekend for a while and replied, "Well, on Saturday I read to my grandmother," he said. She was sick in bed and couldn't read. Children, in this paragraph, it is telling that after a weekend holiday ali went to school it was monday his friend asked him that ali what did you do all weekend children here weekend means saturday and sunday especially regarded as time for leisure two days holiday saturday and sunday it's called weekend holiday then his when ali went to school on monday his friend asked him that ali what did you do all weekend ali thought little and he replied that on sun on saturday he read to his grandmother but his grandmother was sick she was on bed so she couldn't read him okay children now look at the second paragraph And what did you do on Sunday? Asked Samira. Grandfather was out gardening. He was planting flowers and herbs. I joined him. In this paragraph, again, Samira is asking to Ali that Ali, what did you do on Sunday? Ali replied, Grandfather was out gardening. He was planting the flowers and herbs and ali also joined him so children now in this paragraph we will see how ali helped his grandfather in gardening in planting flowers and herbs so let's read it out i showed some seeds and watered the plants i was a lot of fun said ali looking at his friends he continued dad washes his car on sundays i scrubbed it too my mummy needed my help as my baby sister is too small i played with her when she was cross i pretended to be her horse she rode my back and giggled to no end this made me feel really happy now in this paragraph ali is telling that he helped his grandfather by sowing some seeds and watered the plant he was very happy on that day looking at his friends he continued his topic that dad he told his friends that his father used to wash his car on sunday and he also helped him in washing his car his mummy also need his help as his baby sister is too small ali used ali is telling that i played with her and she was cross Uh, i pretended children here ali is telling to his friend that i pretended to be her horse he has he was acting like a horse and his little sister was riding on his back and giggled to no end children here giggled means laugh lightly and repeatedly in a silly way and because of this act of ali her sister was too happy 
and this made Ali feel happy. All this while, the teacher was listening to Ali. She said, You are a very good boy, Ali. You could have spent all your weekend playing and enjoying, but you helped everyone in your family. Why did you do it, Ali? She asked him. In this paragraph, it is telling that when Ali and his friends were talking and discussing about the weekend holiday, <coughs> his teacher was listening to their conversation and his teacher told Ali that you are a very good boy. She was telling you could have spent all your weekend playing and enjoying but you had your family members. Again she asked to him why do you do it Ali? Now in the next paragraph we will see what Ali replied to his teacher. Now see the next one. Ali again thought for a while and then said, Well, I love them and they needed me. Sometimes it's nice to be needed too. His teacher smiled and patted Ali on the back. Ali beamed with happiness and pride. His teacher also looked at him with newfound respect. In this paragraph, Ali replied to his teacher that his family members, he loves to his family members and his family members needed him. Ali felt nice when he helped his family members in all kinds of work. After listening this, his teacher smiled and touched Ali's back and patted on Ali's back. After that, Ali beamed. It means Ali smiled with happiness and pride. His friend also looked at him with newly fond respect. Children, now it's your homework time. Your homework is that you go throughout the chapter again. Children, I hope you all have understood the chapter well. Thank you. Have a nice day.